Hi, I'm going to show you how to divide a line using construction. So, I'm going to have two random lines and I'm going to divide them into 6 and into 12. So, let's quickly have a line over here. Look at that. And let's have a line over here. Look at that. Okay, so the top one I'm going to divide into 6 equal parts. And the bottom one I'm going to divide into 12 equal parts. Now how you do this via construction, obviously you can take the measurement of the line and just divide it by the number you need. If it's an uneven number, this is a great way to divide it. So the first thing we have to do is you need to construct a random line from the one point of the baseline anywhere. The degree doesn't matter. So let's have a random line up here and a random line up here so the next step is you need to put equal points on this line the measurement of these points don't really matter but you can't put huge how can I say distances you can't give huge distances between the points on a line like this because 12 points are not going to fit into this line or 6 points here. So you just want to take a measurement where 6 points can fit equally and 6 and you want to make it a little bit smaller for 12. Okay, there you go. So the next step is you need to connect the last point with the edge of your baseline over here. And from here it's going to be over there. So let's quickly connect them. Okay, there you go. So the next step is actually a trick. You need two set squares for this trick. Now the first set square you need to put on this line parallel to that line, so there, that looks alright, and the second set square you need to fit against this one, so this one can't move right now, until you fit the second set square against it, and now you need to press firmly on this set square, so firmly that this set square, my 30 degree here, can now freely move, so if it freely moves, can make a parallel line on the next point. So, and there you have an equal line over there parallel to the last line we made over here. So, let's quickly put in all these parallel lines. And that is how you divide a line using 